welcome to this special episode of Frequency Matters, the R for Microwave Update series. I'm Pat Hindle, and today I'm talking with Jigger Shaw, Director of Business Development, Sales and Marketing at Quantic Microwave Dynamics. Welcome, Jigger. Hi, Patrick. Hello, everyone. So can you tell us a little bit about Quantic Microwave Dynamics, since some of our audience may not be familiar with the company? Sure. So we were established in 1993 and are located in Irvine, California. Uh, we have a 10K square foot facility and a class 100K clean room. We have hybrid and discrete assembly capabilities. Uh, we specialize in ultra low phase noise frequency control and timing solutions up to 50 gigahertz for mission critical applications. Our core products include free running and phase logged oscillators, including DROs, PLOs, and TCXOs. We also engineer and manufacture amplifiers, frequency converters, and frequency multipliers. We are known for taking on frequency control and timing challenges that others won't or simply can't. Engineers and program managers trust us to deliver the best phase noise and frequency stability performance in the most demanding uh, applications. And as you said, Quantic Microwave Dynamics is well known for pushing the envelope and developing solutions that improve frequency stability, phase noise, and Q factor in our systems. Any new or recent technology advancements that you can tell us about? Advances in PLL integrated DROs. Integrated PLLs slash DROs provide high frequency control and synchronization. Combine the low noise of high quality references at low offsets with DRO's low phase noise at higher offsets. Ideal for applications requiring high frequency accuracy and stability. Reflects quantic microdynamics focus on high performance mission critical solutions. And what are some of the key challenges in the frequency control and timing space and how is quantic microwave dynamics addressing them? High performance in compact designs is one of our biggest challenges. We address this issue with innovative design strategies that maintain performance without compromising size or power consumption. Reliability in harsh environments. We implement advanced environmental sealing, thermal compensation, and vibration isolation techniques to maintain stability and electrical performance. Digital migration, shift from analog RF to digital technologies driven by demand for higher frequencies, most of it from DoD customers. We develop solutions with low phase noise and frequency stability to support this transition. Supply chain challenges, while the situation has improved significantly from a few years ago, we continue to mitigate supply chain risk with rigorous supplier management and strategic sourcing. Quantic Microwave Dynamics is one of the many business units in the Quantic Electronics family of brands. Can you discuss how you all collaborate to meet customer requirements? Close collaboration within the Quantic Electronics Engineering ecosystem is a very important part of our, of our strategy. We leverage the unique strengths and expertise of our fellow divisions and can deliver a variety of solutions to our customers, from RF and microwave to capacitors, resistors, magnetics, and sensing. Regular cross-company meetings and customer projects ensure that we all stay aligned and, and can rapidly respond to evolving customer challenges. We are all working closely together to ensure that we are de delivering the best solutions customized to our customers' challenges. And to wrap it up, how can engineers learn more about Quantic Microwave Dynamics? Learn more about us and our frequency control and timing solutions by visiting our website at quanticmwd.com, calling us at 949-679-7788, connecting with any of our colleagues across Quantic Electronics or by reaching out to me directly. Well, thanks, Jigger, for talking with me today. 
about frequency control and timing developments at Quantic Microwave Dynamics. I know I'm much more familiar with the company, so I appreciate the update. To our audience, you. you can find more videos at videos.microwavejournal.com. Thanks for watching.